Hi everyone. Hi everybody. We are back with our CMD swatching videos because we got these new colors. So I'm so excited to have them. But we only have six because Spain is awesome and the distributor only carries six out of the probably 12. So this is Mulberry Tart and this is a Color World collection. Above my pay grade. Well, half of the exactly. Color World. Collection. Backyard Nuptials. Nuptials? Nuptials? I don't know how to pronounce Nuptials. All frothed up, gilded sage, and frosted sea glass. <laughs> I thought you said seagull. <laughs> frosted seagulls. <laughs> hey, wow. Mulberry tart. So this looks like a, yes, yes. Very good formula, very creamy. By the way, the shellac needs to be mixed really, really well. I suggest a shaker. I'm going to link an interesting video. Okay, this is really good. Above my pay grade. Okay, this one has a very nice creamy formula again. This is going to be a perfect two coater. At the beginning when the polish is brand new, it kind of feels almost grainy. After a while, it's, um, once you mix it maybe a few times, it, it's, uh, Applies differently. Backyard nuptials. Nuptials. That's interesting. Yeah. So this is the first time I'm using these colors. Okay. This is the first time I've ever seen these colors. Yeah, we just got them today. So this reminds me of bouquet on an even nail plate without ridges. This is going to go on very well. So it looks like it's a semi sheer kind of that builds up to almost a coverage but it's not very chalky so it's not going to be similar to like candied or one of those colors this looks like also a sheer color like a sheer dirty white again pretty good application on an even nail plate this is going to go on evenly on ridgy nails these colors never go on evenly gilded sage Okay, another good formula. Very creamy, not very chalky. Frosted seagulls. Frosted sea glass. Very, very good formula on this one as well. These two colors would look amazing on darker skin tones, I think. Like a really little funky colors, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. On the light skin tones, I don't see this working. As well? No, I don't see them working. Well then. All right, round number two. This is flawless. So we're using these colors over the Wear Extender base coat. I've been using it now for a while and I actually like it. I didn't like it at the beginning. I had some weird results, but I don't have any issues now. This is what I do when I mess up a little bit. I find that it cures a little bit drier and the colors go on much better. Okay, I love this color. You know why? No. Because it's almost like a mixture of white and pink. It's very cool without looking too pink or too something. On normal nails, it's going to look good. On ridgy nails, maybe not so much, but it's it's a good application. This also would look good in one coat under French. Let me know if you guys like French nails or not.
Okay. Very good. Very good. I like it. Not sure, actually. <laughs> no, the application is really good. It's good. This looks like a, a green pea color, no? Like a s snap pea? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Also, it's a very good idea to make the first coat quite thin. It soaks off much, much better. And it cures much better too. It wears better. I'm very impressed with the formulas. Extremely impressed.